this week's speaking legal discussion. Good to see you. Good to see you too. Yeah, you ready for this week's question? I am. Yeah, let's do it. All right, let's take a look here. It says, uh, my parents used an online service to create an estate plan. Keyword here is the online service to create it. They told me how it is supposed to work, but when I read the documents, they don't make sense. Can they change it now that they've already created it if it is not right? Okay, he read the documents. He thinks they don't make sense, but mom and dad have done this online. Right. Okay, let's start with the whole online thing. <laughs> well, for, You hear about these. Is this workable? Well, it, it is, and it depends on what you're getting into. But I've got nothing against online services if they're right. I've got several myself out there. We yeah. have MissouriTrafficTickets.com sure. and a lot of online legal services, and they're fine. I'm, I'm a little leery of the estate planning ones and the business service ones just because those types of law are so, uh, they can be so complicated, mm -hmm. they can be so detailed, and there's so, there's so much customization and personalization that you can do for people and it's just really hard to capture what you want your entire estate plan to be about by filling out an online form. I think the question with me or the, the hang up with me would be will it hold up in the state where you live? Yeah, you know, and that's the trick. You don't know because there every time we do an estate plan for somebody, we have a signing ceremony. We've got multiple witnesses, a notary, and all of these people have to be there and it has to be done correctly in order for it to be effective. Right. And so if you don't have all that in place and that guidance you know, I can't, I can't say if it would or wouldn't work. Obviously, they're documents. They have to be signed. And if those are done correctly, then, then great. Um, but we like to offer a lot more customized experience for people. And we see pro a lot of problems with estate plans. And the fact is a majority of estate plans fail. People do their planning, and they don't get ultimately what they're after. And it doesn't necessarily mean that the documents were drafted incorrectly at the time, but it may mean that they weren't drafted as complete as they should have been. It may mean that they weren't kept up with over time. Oh. And so part of what we do is we offer, when we do our planning for people, an extended experience, I guess would be the best way to call it. Yeah. Um, we make people come in for a third meeting and prove that they've taken the steps they need to take, as well as we've taken the steps we need to take to make sure that that plan is effective when they walk out the door. Oh my gosh, you just scared me to death when you said the majority <laughs> of estate plans fail. Um, but again, you, the, for lack of a better word, I guess they need to be babysat a little bit well, along the way. You know, I, I like to talk about it like this. I think of an estate plan in a lot of ways like I, I think about my car. You invest a lot of money to get the car that you want. You want it to get you from where you are to where mm -hmm. you want to go, but it's not a one-time transaction. Yeah. You, know, you buy that car, but then you have to put gas you in it. it. You have to maintain it. And mm -hmm. your estate plan is exactly the same way because your life doesn't stay the same. Yeah. You have to go through the process uh, constantly of looking at your estate and your estate plan and saying, is this still what I want? Is it still taking care of all the assets that I have? Have I moved? Have I bought a car? Have I changed houses? Yeah. Um, am I now looking at some nursing home situations? Do has has one of my beneficiaries gotten married, got divorced, or died? Or died. I mean, you, it, anything could happen. But getting back to this original um, this original letter here. These people had this written out. Can they change it now? Oh, yeah, you can. Add, well, I'm going to assume they can change it. I, I think it would be highly unlikely that they created an irrevocable trust online. It's possible, but I, I highly doubt it. That being the case, um, if it's a revocable trust, which is what most people are going to do, especially if they're just filling out an online form, um, that is completely going to be able to be changed. You, okay. can, you can. That's the whole point of having a revocable trust: is you're in control. You can change them anytime you want. And these problems with the online forms, it's not just with the online forms. I we see it all the time when people bring us, I, for lack of a better term, kind of a cheap estate plan. Yeah. Um, you know, they found somebody that would do their estate plan for one or two twenty-five hundred dollars because yeah. it was cheap, and they got it done. But then they looked at it and it was kind of that one size fits all this is it and nobody took the time to sit down with them and go is this the plan you want do you want to do anything different do you yeah. want to build in any creditor protection for a surviving spouse do you want to build any creditor protection in for your beneficiaries yeah. nobody took the time to do that and then more importantly nobody took the time to make sure that they properly funded that trust and that it was going to be effective that's why we make people meet with us a minimum of three times to make sure that, that that is completely funded and functional and is going to do exactly what the people want it to do. All right, so I hope you got your answer there. You may have to check with the online entity. They may try to upsell 
you if you go in and make changes to it. I don't know. Why don't you print it out and take it to him? Bring it to us. You know? We'll take a look at you it. You can take a look at it. All right. If you have a legal question for Will, email him at wworsham at color10.com. He'll answer your question on the show, and we will see you next week. Right on. All right. Up next, building it better with Sutherland's. Don't go away.